just to see what that looks like. It looks like this. And to me, that was not nearly as informative uh, or immediately informative as to see these lines here. And then I could see there is some differences. Well, I think, first of all, before I jump the gun on the differences across countries, we could see that SAS, I actually rank ordered these to, um, th to make it even more uh, interpretable. Uh, SAS is by far the most popular um, stats package when it comes to job adverts. Uh, we can see that it's probably in the range of you know, somewhere between 55 and 75. So 50, between 55 and 75 percent of job adverts uh, that are statistically oriented and include one of the words, uh, the, one of the eight stats packages that I looked at, which uh, again is over here, one of the, actually 10, one of the 10 stats packages I looked at. So of all the job adverts that included at one of these words, at least one, the range was 55 to 75 percent included the word SAS or acronym SAS. So by far SAS is, is, is the most popular. And then the second most popular is MATLAB. And in the blog post that I um, that I write on this, um, I'll, I'll include the actual exact percentages for the averages. Actually, I've got them up here. Uh, here they are. Uh, maybe ah, I actually deleted that. Uh, anyway, so we've got somewhere in the 20 to 30 ballpark. Uh, so it goes down to 18. Actually, let me analyze that right now. I'll just get the means. Uh, uh, options, descriptives. Let me just put that in there. Redo that. Okay, so for the total countries together, SAS, okay, so it's on average 60. I said between 55 and 75, so it's 60.1% of all job adverts that include at least one of these terms. And I figure that's pretty much all the stats jobs that are going to include. Um, a stats package reference in their job advert. I might be missing some, but it wouldn't be a lot, I don't think. So 61% rounded have the word SAS. Uh, nine, basically 20% include the word MATLAB. SPSS is in third place, 13.6%. Uh, and then there's a pretty big precipitous drop, 3%. Minitab, Stata, 1%. GAMP, 1%. And then you get the rest, Mathematica, Statistica, Systat, NCSS. They're all, they're not even hitting 1%. These are, it's quite rare to see the, these ones in a job advert. Uh, and then JMP Stata, Minitab, you get a little bit, a uh, little bit extra, but then the heavyweights are up here: SAS, MATLAB, SPSS. But still, by far, SAS is, you know, by is leading the pack by by immense. I wouldn't have predicted it was that huge of a difference, but that's what the data suggests. Uh, let me go to the one that I've touched up in terms of the chart. If we look at the um, across individual countries, the trend is very clear. There's a very strong positive manifold, if you will. I didn't calculate the correlations. The correlations would be huge. Uh, so SAS is popular in all countries uh, relative to the other stats packages. MATLAB, though, does have some, there's an interaction here. MATLAB in Australia um, is less popular relative to how popular it is, uh, how, how popular SAS is. So in Australia, SAS is very much the most popular stats package, and it is so at the expense of MATLAB. So I thought that was quite interesting. MATLAB's uh, not relatively interesting. Now bear in mind, these are data that I collected on one day. Uh, today is uh, J July 14th, 2011. I, that's when I collected these data in Indeed.com. Uh, it'd be interesting to track this over time to see if there's any if there's stability in the results. Uh, but anyway, uh, and then SPSS jumps up for for Australia a bit um, relative to other ones. But overall, there's quite a bit of homogeneity in the results, going from the most popular to the least popular. Um, so yeah, I guess these are we have we now have data. Uh, if you've ever been wondering, well, what stats package is the most popular? I realize there's a number of ways to address this question. I tried one way, which is the number of hits its website gets. Uh, and this is another way. I think this way is, uh, is arguably possibly more sophisticated. Um, 
uh, it's a different angle, uh, and uh, it, it's given some pretty interesting results. I think if you are looking for a job in stats, uh, SAS would be the most popular one. Uh, you, you'd be the most likely to get your job, all other things being equal. What I'll also mention here, though, 